The Hatch command receives several enhancements in AutoCAD LT 2011 to help you create and edit Hatch objects faster and easier. When you start the Hatch command, a new contextual ribbon tab appears instead of a dialog box. This tab contains everything you need to create your Hatch object. You can set the pattern, scale, angle, origin, and more. When using the Pick Points method, a new preview function enables you to see what the hatch would look like before you click. You can also see the result of each click as you pick points or objects in the drawing. Keep in mind that even though it looks as though a hatch was created as you clicked, it will not actually be a separate object unless you have the Create Separate Hatches option on. AutoCAD LT 2011 continues to expand object grip functionality with a new center grip for direct manipulation of hatch objects. When you hover over the grip, a menu appears with options to change the origin, angle, and scale of the hatch directly without going through a dialog. You can either choose an option from the list or left click on the grip and use control to cycle through the different behaviors. Hatch objects now support a background color in addition to line color. This enables you to have the effect of layering hatches in a single object. You also have the option to set a hatches layer as you create it. You can choose to use the current layer or pick one from the drawing. The hatch layer setting is persistent in a drawing session, making it easy to place all your hatches on the correct layer. When you mirror a hatch object in AutoCAD LT 2011, its original angle is now maintained. You can use the new system variable mirror hatch to return to the legacy behavior and have the hatch angle mirror along with the boundary object. The last improvement to hatching is straight from the Augie wish list. A new option in the draw order flyout on the modify panel of the home tab is send hatches to back, which places hatch objects under all other geometry in the drawing. Along with bring text to front and bring dimensions to front, Send hatches to back is one more way to gain control over the appearance of your drawing.